Good afternoon, brothers and sisters. This is Sister Susie. I wanted to share with you the dream the Lord showed me last night, April the 18th, in the night. I dreamed that I was on the road with my sister and we were walking towards our home. We were going home. And as we were on, walking towards our home, there was um, a big truck that was following us behind. In this big truck, I saw that, you know, it was carrying huge boxes um, at the back. And, uh, and on, on top of these huge boxes were seated three men. And one of the men I could recognize uh, that it was Obama. And, um, and there was another fourth man that was behind these three men. And this fourth man behind them seemed to, to be like he was uh, their boss. And he was so happy, this, this boss of theirs, he was so happy, he was telling them that, uh, you know, they have a new technology, you know. And Obama, I saw Obama's face, he was, had a big grin on his face, like happy, smiling. And all of them were so happy, you know. And um, the man behind, he was standing and he, he held this huge box and he was opening the huge box, showing them that, you know, they had accomplished the huge technology they were waiting for. And anyway, that was the kind of like the end of the, the dream. And when I woke up, I started praying to the Lord for interpretation of the dream. And in my heart, the Lord kind of like revealed to me that the devil and the Antichrist, they are ready now. The new world order is ready to start at any moment. Everything they need to, to set up this system is ready. And, uh, I do believe they're just waiting for the rapture of the church and everything will happen. And, you know, as, as the dream was saying, uh, we were walking towards our home. Our home might symbolize our heavenly home. Anyway, I have a verse, you know, just to clarify on the um, technology that they are bringing, which is in Revelations 13, verse 16. It says, also, he compels... Oh, both small and great, both the rich and the poor, both free and the slave, to be marked with an inscription stamped on their right hands or on their foreheads, so that no one will have the power to buy or sell unless he bears the stamp that is the name of the beast or the number of his name. Here is room for discernment. I call for the wisdom of interpretation. Let anyone who has intelligence Calculate the number of the beast, for it is the human number, the number of a certain man. His number is 666. So, since I do believe the Lord was just letting us know that they are ready. The Antichrist and, he, and Satan, they are ready. So, for us, we need to continue to repent. We need to continue to cleanse. And uh, just every day, go before the Lord. We have to keep on... Um, asking for mercy because you just never know if you are clean enough no one knows it's only the lord who knows how clean we are so that's just a short you know short dream that i wanted to tell you the lord letting us know that the devil and the antichrist they are ready and also we as christians we must be ready so that's it for today uh see you next time bye